Thanks for taking him, Seth. No, no problem, Jane. How are you? Good. Hey, don't what touch that. I'm okay? not a piece of meat. You two are funny. I can't imagine what you're going to do without each other next year. Evan told me you didn't get into Dartmouth. I got into some schools, some pretty good ones, so I'll be fine. You going to miss each other? No, miss each other? No, thank you. I know I don't miss each other. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna cry myself to sleep every night. Me too. When I'm out partying. Go to school, boys. Bye, Mom. Bye, Jane. I am truly jealous you got to suck on those tits when you were a baby. Yeah, well, at least you got to suck on your dad's dick. Hey, Jules. Your partner didn't come today? It's kind of a personal question. What? Nothing. It's my attempt at humor. I was just... <laughs> oh, like coming. <laughs> like coming, coming. <laughs> wow, this is a little too far right there. The gesture. Yeah, it's pretty far. Shit, I do that. No, oh, don't worry. I'm, I'm actually uh, used to it. My older brother says, like, the nastiest shit. Like, he called me Hymen until I was 12. Oh, that's, that's, sick. that's sick. I know. That's not even clever. I know. You know, I would have gone with something, you know, at least, like, mildly entertaining. You know, like, 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 family jewels. Oh, like, nuts. Yeah, that's funny. That's a fucking funny joke. That's fucking funny. I can't believe that. It's all right. We gotta mix it up. Gangsters, what's up, guys? I was just walking down the hall, and uh, Nicola was right in front of me. She was wearing these tight white pants with this black g-string, and you could see right through the pants, man. It was so sweet. Uh, it's 10.33. Here, here. What? I told her what time it was. That's the coolest fucking story I've ever heard in my entire life. That's insane. Is it, can I hear it again? Do you have time? Yeah, yeah, Seth. I'm really gonna miss your uh, knee slappers when me and Evan are at Dartmouth. Yeah, well, you guys are at Dartmouth. I'll be over at State where the girls are half as smart and thus twice as likely to fellash me. What are you guys doing tonight, asshole? We got nothing, nothing tonight, Fogel. No, well, if nothing comes up, we can get shit-faced again, yeah? I mean, you always call me a pussy and whatnot, but today you're wrong. At lunch, I'm going to the same place Mike Snyder went to pick up my brand new fake ID. Check out, check out, yeah, fake ID, fake ID. That's insane, because everyone was just like, I heard about this party and we shouldn't tell Fogo about it. And I was like, no, you should totally tell Fogo, and that way you could buy his booze now. It's awesome. Yeah, I'll sure I'll buy the booze. Yeah, I mean, we're going to get our drinks on and we're going to party and get crunk and brought out, dude. If you're not in this class, leave this class. Fogo! Hi! Okay, I'm... Um, well done, man. Go. Seriously, see you after class. Like, 8% of kids do it, but whatever. It's... For some reason, I don't know why, just kind of sit around all day and draw pictures of dicks. What? Draw pictures of dicks. Dicks? Like a man dick? Yeah. Like a man dick. I just sit there for hours on end drawing dicks. I don't know what it was. I couldn't touch the pen to a piece of paper without it drawing the shape of a penis. That's fucked. No shit, it's really fucked up. Here I am, this little kid, and I can't stop drawing dicks to save my own life. All right, I mean, I just, I don't see what this has to do with Becca. Just listen, okay? Your precious little Becca sat next to me for all of fourth grade. And in the classroom is where I did the majority of my illustrations. 
I was very secretive about this whole dick operation I had going on. Even I thought I was fucking crazy. Imagine what everyone else would think. So I would stash all of my dick drawings in this Ghostbusters lunchbox that I had. So one day, finishing up this real big, veiny, triumphant bastard, all of a sudden... Pussy. You hit Becca's foot with your dick? Yeah. I know. She starts crying, she flips out. And she rats me out to the principal. He finds his Ghostbusters lunchbox dick treasure chest and he fucking flips out. He calls in my parents. Turns out this principal is some sort of religious fanatic and he thinks I'm possessed by some sort of dick devil. My parents make me go see some therapist and he's asking me all these dick questions. They literally made me stop eating foods that were shaped like dicks. No hot dogs, no popsicles. You know how many foods are shaped like dicks? The best kinds. Yeah. Well, I don't, I, that's really messed up. Yeah, I'm gonna get one, for show, for show. I'm getting that for show. <laughs> Can you get us booze? Yeah, I can. I can get you guys alcohol. Really? Seriously? Yes, oh. for sure. Oh, that yeah. would be awesome. Thank you. So because, good. you know, we're worried yeah. about that. That would be great. Plus, you know, you scratch our backs, we'll scratch yours. Well, Jules, the funny thing about my back is, is that it's located on my cock. <laughs> <laughs> fucking listen, okay? Jules and her stupid fucking friend came up to me, and they asked me to buy her alcohol. But not just her, for a whole party. You know what that means? By some divine miracle, we were paired up, and she actually thought of me. Thought of me enough to decide that I was the guy she would trust with the whole funness of her party. She wants to fuck me. She wants my dick in and around her mouth. Did you ever think that maybe she's just using you to get her alcohol? She doesn't want your dick. <laughs> yes, of course I thought of that. That's like the first thing that came to my mind. Just listen. My older brother always says, like, the nastiest shit. Like, he called me Hyman until I was 12. Seth, I want to blow you. And she didn't say that, come on. <laughs> she didn't say the second part, but the first part, she's got an older brother. And she could have asked him, but she asked me. She looked me in the eyes and said, Seth, Mom is making a pubie salad, and I need some Seth's own dressing. She's DTF. She's down to fuck, man. Right. P and VG. She wants to fuck, man. Tonight is a night that fucking is an actual possibility. You just sound like an idiot. You're not going to be able to sleep with her, man. No. Dude, I don't want to talk a lot of shit, okay? But she's gonna be at the party, and she's gonna be drunk, and she likes me at least a little enough to get with me. At the very least, I'll make out with her. Two weeks hand job, month blowjob, whatever, whatever. And then I make her my girlfriend. And I've got like two solid months of sex. By the time college rolls around, I'll be like the Iron Chef of Pound and Vage. Okay, can you just get out of here and we'll, we'll talk what about this later? Fuck, Evan, we're down two points. Fucking calm down, Greg. It's soccer. It's soccer. Fuck you, man. Hey, Greg, why don't you go piss your pants again? That was like eight years ago, asshole. People don't forget. All right, you talk to Becca, I'll talk to that retard Fogel. Don't worry. Seth, get off the field! Come on! You're getting that! No, I'm not! Yeah, no, that would be great. That would save me such a hassle, because I was going to beg my sister, but... Oh. Could you give me, like, a bottle of gold slick vodka? Yeah, that's the one with the little golden flakes in it. Yeah, the girly one. It's classy. Um, okay, well, I'll pay you back at the party, then. No, 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 you won't. No, it's my treat, miss... Really? Yep, and that's that. It's the first of many, too, so get used to it, sister. Oh, well, thank you. Yeah, no Thanks. problem. You... Oh. I'm sorry. That guy walked by. It was an accident. Okay. Um, I was going to give you, like, a nudge on the, like, a punch, a friend thing. It's okay. I didn't mean, I'm sorry. Hey, that... Becca. Oh, hey. Hey. Bobby. What's Hi. up, Evan? Hey, Gabby. We should get to class. We're going to go to class, so I will see you tonight. Okay. Really, don't worry. Okay, sorry. Okay, bye. Sorry. Bye. Sorry.